question is if O plus 2 is equal to out, what is O plus U plus P? This has been R in process. This has been R in process. Not a difficult question. Of course, this one is very easy. Huh? Sometimes you get a little bit difficult. Huh? These are known as script arithmetic, analytical arithmetic, or verbal arithmetic. It is script arithmetic, analytical arithmetic, verbal arithmetic. People use different terminologies because alphabets are there, they call it a verbal arithmetic. Or it is script arithmetic. But a simple system. See, we are in our doing like this, write it like this, which will be very simple. G plus 2 will be equal to O U T. Now, when I add two digit numbers, two two digit numbers, I am getting a three digit number. This is the cash point, this very simple one. When I add two two digit numbers, the I get a three digit number. See, these are the, all of you will agree, 99 plus 99 is the maximum two digit number. So, nothing to do with this, I am just explaining. What happens is, when I total this, it will be 8, 198. So, this becomes a three digit number. I have taken the maximum two digit numbers here. I have taken the maximum two digit numbers. For the sake of explanation, the maximum carryover can only be one. When I am adding two two digit numbers, by getting a three digit number, the maximum carryover can only be one. Therefore, wherever I have got O, it can only be 1. Because I have taken the largest two digit number in both the cases, and the maximum carryover is only 1. So, if I am getting a three digit number here, O can only be 1. Now, substitute wherever I have got O, same 1. Now, once you substitute O as 2, T will become 2. Once you substitute O as o, o 1, T will become 2. The moment I write P as 2, I am getting a three digit number. So, if I am going to get a three digit number, what will happen is, here I will have to get two plus t plus g or 2 plus g should be at least 10, then only I can get a three digit number. Because 2 plus g should have a carryover, then only I can get a carryover number here. Now, there are two possibilities, because 2 is here, there is no carryover from here, so g can only be 8 or 9, g can only be 8 or 9, in case I g as 9, 9 plus 2 will become 1, O will also be 1. In case I write G as 9, I am just explaining. G as 9, 9 plus 2 will be 1. O is 1, U also cannot be 1. Therefore, G cannot be 9. It can only be 8. This will become 0. So, O plus U plus T is what is being asked. 1 plus 0 plus 2 will be equal to 3. The answer is 3. As simple as this, the similar question will be there. Light will be a little bit difficult. Where you will not even go to link these numbers like this. You will not even go to link these numbers. Once you are able to link, it is easier. We will be seeing all those questions. I will be adding questions more of Infosys for 4 or 5 days because uh, Infosys exam is likely to take place within 4 or 5 days' time. So, I am going to add more of Infosys questions. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions here in a moment. Wish you all the best.